Dan is Contoso's CEO. Unfortunately, Contoso's recent sales results have consistently come in below expectations. Dan is considering a recommended plan to improve future sales. Dan is looking for data confirmation that by offering the proposed discount in appropriate areas, Contoso would expect to increase volume enough to make up for lost margins. Dan reviews the executive dashboard, and in doing some basic assumptions modeling, he confirms that making a targeted but significant discount available should indeed help sales results. Dan decides to authorize the discount for most regions. Dan is also interested in the sales Contoso transacts via its channel partners. Is there anything Contoso can do to improve their situation? Looking at the channel data in his executive dashboard, Dan sees that the rate of in-store product returns is running very high. Using a new analytical feature available right in the browser called Decomposition Trees, he's able to break down the high return rate number to understand exactly where and exactly what are the drivers of the problem. In doing this analysis, Dan finds that much of the high return rate is localized to a particular geography and is primarily associated with related lines of washers and dryers. From his dashboard, Dan can create a basic sales report highlighting the root of the return problem. He exports this sales report to Excel and sends it off to his channel management team to investigate further and attempt to remedy. The last thing that Dan will do is communicate with employees. His decision to discount represents a pretty big strategy shift, and employees are going to want to know what's going on and why the decision was made. Dan's blog represents an efficient and accessible way for him to share important thoughts with everyone at Contoso. Dan was able to tap into insights and get appropriate context when making and communicating around an important decision.